Hi, welcome our Smart Gnome. We are working to make it beautiful and nice. We've just added here this little icon up here with an extension. Change some icons around and a new theme and all that. So to have some fun to see how everything feels. But where are the settings in Gnome? So we have this menu and activities. We can add things and remove things to the favorites. So right mouse click. You can have here all the applications, well, frequent, frequent and all. So whenever you click or you can also drag like so. So the calendar is in here, we can remove it again. Not sure if you can remove it like so. So no cloud like in Mac, we can remove it and poof, it's gone. Would be a nice idea, guys, of GNOME. Anyway, so we have um, also a settings folder. We, sh we should type it actually, I think. So we need the settings as well. So settings is a thing that you need to have around. So add to favorites. Two things I've been using last week a lot of times is the settings and then the tweaks, so the GNOME tweak tool. All right, so these two. Fine, let's have a look. What's in here? In here, let's make it big. I am, of course, not on a laptop, so no Wi-Fi connected. Bluetooth is a virtual box, so not found. Background, we saw the background already. It's variety that's taking over all the backgrounds. Notifications, if you don't want them, do want them. Everything is available here. Search, wherever you want to search or do not want to search, you can add it here. The region is from my choice here, English, but you can add other things. Cancel and formats is United States, but again, you can add here with these three little dots. You can add more. Sometimes if you're mistaking, if you did the installation, it's, oh damn, I have the wrong keyboard. Well, you can add keyboards here. So that's everything as usual, let's say. So universal access, high contrast, um, large text, the things we can do if we are not able to type or hear or see or pointing and clicking. Online accounts have not done anything, of course, but there is there are possibilities here to link to some services. Privacy, screen lock is on or not. Location services off, usage history is on. Clear recent history. And purge trash or empty trash and temporary files and all that. Okay. Sharing, if we want to have file sharing on, some I suppose, screen sharing on, media sharing on, remote login. I haven't tried these, but it's here. Sound, we have our own sound um, tool here. But I do have I have Pavo Control installed. Not sure if it's in here. Let's have a look. Pavo Control is already installed via the scripts. So that's this application I really need it for my Bluetooth headset. And it's so easy to configure in here, playback, Spotify is here, pop, click, done. So it's for me uh, easier. But this is the, no the normal GNOME thing. Um, by the way, you might have seen something strange pop up. So Super Shift D is one of the keyboard shortcuts that I migrated from i3. So it is D menu. Everything is there. It's, it's in my fingers. We have an extra menu there up there. It works. Okay, so power, blank screen, every after five minutes or never. Automatic suspend, off or on. These options are all available. Network connection, you can add things, VPN, and then the devices. This is quite important, guys. Hope you're watching because sometimes you are looking for things and they are, in my view, hidden away. Like the keyboard shortcuts, there are in here, in the devices. That's where you find them, and there you see variety minus F, meaning I favorite this wallpaper that's old F. I trash this wallpaper, old T. Next wallpaper, previous and next, you see. So even control old U, so the pavel control, it's all in here. What you used to have on Arch Merch is going to be in here, because otherwise I would miss it. All right, mouse touchpads, if you have left or right, mouse speed, natural scrolling, no touchpad av available since uh, this is desktop orientations and things. Light, night light, I've used at a, a time 
at some time I well did not see any difference really might be me but here it is so check it out what this is and then removable media standard stuff Wacom color all right and then details so here it is Intel Core 64 bits Oracle virtual box taking time if you want to change that requires internet access automatic time zone uh, why not ah. date and time okay correct time zone mm -hmm. fine time format am pm changes in the middle up there and then users that's eric logged in automatic logged in <laughs> i am automatically logged in but it's not on here and then default applications maybe you would change things in here you'll see well music that beef maybe gnome player we're on gnome so it's installed and new video rather than vlc photos and so on so we've seen all the settings now and um, that's it enjoy your system